السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وأصحابه ومن اهتدى بهداه وبعد All praise is indeed due to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Blessings and salutations upon Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to bless every single one of us and we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to make us from amongst those whose salah, whose prayers are accepted inshallah. From amongst those whose fasting in this month is accepted inshallah. Bearing in mind that we have not yet completed the month, really. This is a season of forgiveness from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to forgive every single one of us. The one who achieves forgiveness has achieved a lot in the month of Ramadan. The hadith the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, وَيْلٌ لِمَنْ أَدْرَكَ رَمَضَانَ فَلَمْ يُغْفَرْ لَهُ Destruction be upon the one who has witnessed the month of mercy and has not achieved forgiveness. The one who has seen the month of Ramadan and still did not get forgiveness. That means when the month is there, where mercy is being dished out and the forgiveness is being handed and distributed, a loser is the one who does not get from that mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So we ask for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's mercy. Also, as we commence this evening, it is important that we make mention of the hadith where Aisha radiallahu anha asked the Prophet, peace be upon him, O Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, if I find the night of decree, which is Laylatul Qadr, what should I say? So he responded, Say, Allahumma innaka afuun to hibbul afwa fa'fu anni. O oh Allah, you are most forgiving, you love to forgive, so forgive me. That is the most powerful dua you could make on the night of decree or Laylatul Qadr. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to forgive us.